Today we're gonna to be swatching the clean color Madly Matte Lipsticks from the Red Collection. The clean color Madly Matte Lipsticks rolled out sometime in 2015. They were featured on Shop Miss A where the whole collection, all 30 shades, were just $1 per lipstick. You can also find these on the Clean Color website and I will link both of those sites below. Today we'll be featuring the Red Collection and there are six shades in this collection. I will do some lip swatches, I'll put a photo of the ingredients, and I'll also share the names as we go along. This is number 25, Sienna. You guys are lucky because you get to see the sexiest hands in the business. Yes honey, they're very good. We're talking about yours, right? Both of ours. Because they're seeing two hands, mine and yours. Those are the two sexiest hands in all of swatching. That's right, our other hands are disgusting. See, like, I've got that sexy vein right there. This is number 26, Antique Ruby. So how does a ruby look different if it's antique? How does that change the color? How is it different from modern ruby? This is number 27, Cafe Noir. That's not red. No, oh, what is it supposed to be? It's supposed to be, it says Cafe Noir, so I guess it is more in the cafe spectrum, but this is all supposed to be different reds. <clears throat> that would probably look good on someone with red hair. Argan Oil Cleansing Cloths. This is number 28, Rosewood. That's really pretty. It's interesting with the, uh, it goes red, red, brown, and then yeah, I know. red again. This is number 29, Aubergine, which literally means purple, right? Like it's an eggplant. Eggplant, the color is purple, right? I didn't know aubergine meant eggplant. Is that a different language? It is French. Okay, and this is number 30, Fandango. Thanks so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out my Instagram glossary of tags. <laughs>